<clears throat> Sal Capano tuning in on this Friday evening. Hope everybody's doing well. I'm smoking a uh, page. It's a Camacho barrel age. For those who watch my videos, everybody's got their top 10 list. I'll put this on my top 10 list, probably around number four or five. You know that my top cigar is VSG. Ashton VSG, Sorcerer. Robusto is pretty good. But it's a barrel age. Uh, it's good smoke for the price and like I said this is right up there and maybe my fourth or fifth best stick I've smoked <clears throat> so far it's, uh, sorry a little cold tonight in Vegas I like the edges here Sorry about that. Anyhow, starts off. You don't get much in the beginning. So it's, it's a little, you got a great draw. But you start tasting the, the sweetness in it. The uh, That barrel age comes in in about three, four minutes. I like the size too. Um, no pepper. In my opinion, I don't, I don't taste any pepper at all. A little hint of cocoa in it. Maybe some vanilla. It's a good smoke. So Camacho Barrel Age. I like all Camachos. They're, pretty much all their Camachos are pretty uh, consistent. Um, but, you know, you can get them as cheap as 6 bucks online. You know, most of your stores going to, you know jack them up a little bit to ten dollars but uh everybody's got different tastes that's what's that's what's great about cigars and it brings great conversation doesn't it some of you's got some great videos out there with cigars how to light it and this and that but the one thing when you light a cigar you don't want to burn it so you don't want it too close you want to keep it away from the cigar a little bit a little chilly tonight got my heater on tonight so what do you want from me Watching a little football game. Chilling. Enjoying the cigar. And shit, I'm out of uh I'm out of water. Yeah, I'm out of alcohol too. I'm going down to like maybe that much. Oh my Johnny Walker Blue. I gotta stock up. But uh I'm hoping everybody's having a pleasant Friday going into the weekend. If you're off on the weekend, enjoy it. Christmas is coming up. Got to start doing some Christmas shopping. I'm still old fashioned. I like to, I don't like, uh, you know, Italians and Una getting, get money out. My kids are growing up and stepkids and whatnot. But I like, it. even if it's a gift card, it's, it's something about it. It's just my opinion, you know. So Christmas is coming up for you people out there. You know, get your Christmas shopping in. Boy, these fucking stores closed down. <laughs> so I'll probably do that either this weekend or next weekend. What do you want from me? Got to get in the mood for it. I get in the mood. I get I get up in the morning, get my coffee going, and get a cigar, and I just go at it. Bada boom, bada bang. Hit all the women get a Victoria's Secret. You know, I don't online shit. I hate. I got an online thing from my wife. Some scissors. She's a hairdresser. Fucking eBay. Get the fuck out of here. I ordered last Sunday. Still says in process. Oh, fuck. Send the fucking scissors out. Cocksuckers. I sell on eBay. I put the fucking thing. I can't sleep at night if I don't get the thing out. Send the motherfucking thing out. Uh, I had a runny nose. No, it's not coronavirus. It's cold. It's cold for me. Got Italian blood. It's about 20 degrees out here tonight. I'm just kidding. It's It's colder. Uh, so yeah, man, uh, so just, uh, some of my clients now are coming down with the coronavirus and I'm a fitness trainer. So some of the, uh, some of my clients just got tested positive. Some of my old, I got a lot of older clients. Uh, they're doing all right. 
doing fine. They said they're ready to go back to the gym. I don't want them to, but uh, they're doing good. They got a quarantine for their two weeks, and uh, but uh, less and less people at the gym. You know, more more and more people are getting. You know, I'm not here to judge. You get scared to go. Although the gym, your immune system keeps your immune system up, your mind and all that. I'm not getting into that too much right now, but. Uh, I don't know. Like I said on my, if you watch my video yesterday, if you didn't watch it and share it, these fucking doctors and scientists instead of coming out with this, that, whatever, I'll see it when I believe it. And I've talked into these doctors. I have about three or four doctor clients and two clients. Really, doctors have been around for a while, my age and older, and they're all saying the same thing. They're all saying, "Well, I don't know if I want to take it. What the fuck? They don't want to take it. The vaccine I'm talking about. That's some serious side effects to this shit." Well, they're going to have us by the fucking boss. Because if you want to go to Europe, I heard, I'm sure you guys heard, go, 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 motherfucker, keep going. Get the fucking over in this game. How do you fucking fumbles the ball? As soon as I open my big fucking mouth. You cocksucker. Get back to the video. I got some fucking fazools on this game. I make some money somehow. Um... I forgot what I was saying. I haven't even had a drink yet. Oh, these doctors. I'm hearing that most of my doctor clients and friends, they don't want, they're not even sure about these side effects. You know, easier said than done, man. I don't know about you guys, how you feel. Leave your comments below. I ain't heard it takes no fucking, uh, I don't want no fucking value. I don't even like the flu in me. That's just my opinion. I don't put no shit in me. Oh, they'll pay you $1,200. Ain't paying me nothing. You can pay me a million dollars. I would, a million dollars? I might take it. <laughs> At Ashton BSG? No, seriously, I'm joking aside. I, I'm just surprised. I, we're the fuck supposed to be the smartest nation. Oh, fuck. You can, you can get together and, and get something going, get people's mind relaxed. Hey, I said it yesterday. What the fuck? I'm really surprised. Oh, one of my doctor clients says, well, Sal, you're a little hard. I said, hard on what? Takes time. These things should take three years. Sometimes this this is a very complicated situation. What complicated? That's what what complicated? Put some fucking garlic and hot peppers and fucking parsley together. Put it in a fucking jar and inject that into somebody. Do the fucking natural way. I don't know. Do something. I'm fucking getting tired of this shit. And I said yesterday was true, people. It's get our backs are against the wall. And they better come up with some fucking uh, a, a fucking stimulus package for these people. There's a lot of people out there fucking dying. Not from the coronavirus, they're dying. Seriously. People are losing their fucking, everything they work for. Their houses, they're getting depressed. Living in a fucking box now, and some people are homeless. Drinking, drugs. It's too much. I never thought I'd see anything like that. I'm sure more of you guys, this is... They go on, uh, they keep, continue this long. Kids, kids, kids still out of school in most states. It's just, it's fucking aggravating. You, you try not to think about it, but shit, they're all around us. And it's just hard to believe that it's going by this long and these motherfuckers can't get something together. You, you know it, guys, and I know it. They could. They don't want to. They want us to fucking die. Let's kill as many old people and people we can. Yeah. These cocksuckers. Oh, did you hear the update? Barack Obama, George Bush, Clinton, and his fucking Biden. They will all say, well, we'll go in front of a camera and we'll be the first to take it. Who are you fucking kidding? You ain't going to fucking inject it. You're going to put fucking water in there. I think, we're, I think I was born yesterday and they're going to fucking show everybody, oh, we're alive. Yeah, right. Oh, I was born. I was born yesterday. Yeah, you're going to go on a fucking camera and inject that fucking shit. You ain't gonna fucking inject that shit. The fuck out of here, cocksucking lying motherfuckers. I hate them all right now. That's why we needed Trump. They're all bad. Republicans and Democrats. These jerk offs. What a world we're living in. I'm gonna finish up this barrel age. Hit the like button, share the video. Let's hope they fucking send some money out to us. People need it, man. Maybe some of us don't need it, but there's a lot of people out there who really, really need it, truthfully. 
Like I said in my previous videos, ain't gonna be no fucking small businesses anymore. Might not have anything anymore. We're starting to see it, man. We're starting to see socialism. They're gonna be sending us the fucking food they want us to eat. Send us the doctor we they want you to go to. Send your kids to school they want you to go to. Turn the TV on when they want you to 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 do. You know? Smoke a cigar when they want you to smoke or not smoke at all. The fuck out of here. All right, everybody, enjoy your weekend if you have it off. If not, still enjoy it. Take it, take one day at a time. And now this is starting to open up a little bit. Don't you hate when you're smoking and you get a piece of the fucking seeds in your mouth? Oh. Try the cigar out. Camacho Barrel Age. Come on for me. Might like it. Ciao.